Rising fuel costs and climate change have created the need to reduce fuel consumption and the emission of greenhouse gases. Taken forward this step in a project funded by the Norwegian government with the introduction of a bulbous bow on long line fishing vessels in Granada. The way the bulbous bow works is that while the stem of a boat creates a forward wave that crashes into the side of the boat a few meters further back creating resistance, the bulbous bow creates a similar wave that interferes with the stem wave nullifying the wave impacting the hull and diminishing the resistance of the boat while traveling through the water significantly. Well, the Barbers Bow, I was really interested in that project as well because I've uh, been sailing for part of my life. I started researching the Barbers Bow uh, on the in, on internet, then I saw it is and I get the opportunity to get the chance to put it on my boat as a test, 100% sure that the boat is going to be a different boat in the ocean now. My name is Clyde Frank, I am a boat builder from Pier Matnik. I was responsible for building the dihedral bulbous boat for the longline grey fishing vessel. It was a very nice challenge and it was very exciting to build the bulbous bow. Very effective for the longline boat to use this technology as you go build very consumption for fuel saving on the long run. Okay, um, my name is Justin Rennie. I'm the Chief Fisheries Officer uh, for Grenada within the Fisheries Division of the Ministry of Agriculture and Lands, Forestry and Marine Resources. The idea for Bulbul's Bow, it's um, something new, although the technology is not new, but it is new to our region, but more so to the uh, fishing industry. I think that the Bulbul's Bow will be a significant benefit to our fishing industry. For example, we know that the cost of fuel um, is very, very high in our region and in Grenada. Besides this fuel saving exercise, the bulbous bow also reduces the heaving and pitching of a boat in bad weather, making the boat much more stable and easier to operate. The way the bulbous bow was created is the shape of the boat was taken and two meter scale models were produced at the university in Spain. These were tank tested with and without the bulbous bow and results showed significant improvements in sea keeping as well as a reduction in fuel consumption by 18 to 20 percent. We hope these will repeat themselves in the real world of fishing and benefit the fishers of Grenada.